Hey guys, Stamming7 here. Welcome to London AX Moto 1. Should be a really fun moto here. This track is definitely going to be insane with how tight it is. Um, probably one of the tightest arena crosses that we have raced so far in HRL, so definitely definitely expect to see a lot of cheese here. It's going to be going to be a crazy pass fest, a wreck fest. There's there's going to be a lot of a lot of cheese going on. So, just waiting for the gate to drop now. It's going to be interesting to see who's going to get the whole shot. Looking on the people on the inside, and here we go, green flag. And speaking of that inside row, oh, Slunch gets cheesed into the inside wall. That is unfortunate. It looks like Ump's going to take the whole shot. Flame's gone over the track. Hunter's gone into the, the, the next inside wall. Oh, we have like a four wide, four or five wide. Oh, Bean with the, with the wheelie, and then into the inside wall. Okay, I can't even follow all the cheese that's going on right now. It's It's already been unloaded. This is... This is getting ridiculous. Looks like Ump's off to the early lead um, with Slaunch already, or yeah, Slaunch trailing in second, Hunter in third, and Roman in fourth. So Roman really picking it up after the heat race. Fireball goes down. He's going to lose a lot of positions off that. Oh! More collisions, more two wides. Literally everything that can go cheesy is going cheesy. Gonna be an interesting battle here. Oh, is that a lap driver? No, I don't think so. I think that was Detail getting really loose right there, or Elite getting really loose, and Detail also getting loose trying to uh, avoid him. So Ump with a pretty solid lead now. Slaunch in second, Hunter third, Roman fourth. So that stays the same. Camby is in fifth. Definitely much improved um, from his heat races. good position for him to be in. Here's Rebel, buried deep in the pack. Um, not a very good start for him, obviously. Whoa! One driver going down in the back. It looks like it was Bean. Very unfortunate for him. Looks like it's starting to single out a little bit. Flame getting back into the mix uh, with the lap traffic, so that's going to be interesting. Vulcan making moves. On Elite, it looks... Whoa! Elite makes the move over Vulcan. I don't know if you guys missed that, but that was amazing. If if you missed that, go back and rewatch that. Vulcan, <laughs> Elite, and Vulcan were like side by side. Elite decided to go for the jump line, which is rarely hit. And he hit it and was able to pass, like, drop right dead in front of Vulcan. That was honestly one of the greatest things I've ever seen. That was just... That was just... That was just great. Oh, no. Rebel and Fireball getting into it, going down. Uh, Rebel getting cheese down the rhythm as well. This is just not a good start for him. Fireball also very rough races for those two drivers, and those are two of the drivers with the best um, point seasons so far. So um, seeing them get roughed up a lot is definitely going to be something that the uh, the rest of the field is going to be looking forward to if they're trying to compete in these point standings. But obviously, Rebel and Fireball are not not excited about that. I um, think that's Luke in detail right there battling for 6th and 7th, it appears. Um, as they're trying to catch up to Camby. Yep, it is those two. There's Fireball and Rebel. A little bit further behind. Vulcan way deep in this pack now. Bean as well. Ump's already lapping people, so he's got a pretty solid lead. Slaunch, uh, not really able to cut into it yet. Hunter's, it looks like Hunter's actually gaining on Slaunch. Hunter's um, genuinely fast at this track. He's uh, running solid laps. I like this shot because you can really see a lot of the different lines that, uh, whoa! Bottom right corner, I don't know if you guys saw that, Fireball almost just went down, but um, I like I like how in this shot you can see so many different lines being taken. It's um, really fun to watch how these drivers have different ways around the track. Looks like Vulcan gets into it with Elite. Coming on the exit of the rhythm is where it happened. Roman having a great race, just tracking the top three and fourth. So, this is definitely a uh, worthy start for him, way better than a seat race. Showing that he's got some speed. Whoa, Slaunch, lapping flame. Could have been could have been bad right there, but he's able to get by him. Oh, flame on the rhythm. Driver's going to have to watch out for that. Fireball is putting him off to the side. Flame getting cheesed in the inside wall. Fireball taking things into his own hands right there. Roman trying to get by him now. Two Double two wides right there. Um, 
mostly lap traffic two wides i believe that was really dangerous i don't know if anybody saw that with ump but he almost got rko'd trying to lap by vulcan now and fireball or sorry sane as well it's hard to tell because sane decided to pick a core goose this race and him and fireball both look extremely white and they both have core gooses so i can't tell the difference <laughs> i literally can't look way too similar um when they have the same goose Things are starting to single out, mostly. Although I have a feeling we will see some battles soon. These drivers are not uh, separated by that much. Is that a pass just being made in the rhythm section right there? Looks like it. Looks like Roman um, trying to get by some drivers. Whoa! I believe that's Fireball getting loose right there. That was weird. I don't know if anybody saw that. Vulcan actually um, rolled over on the on the back stretch oh slaunch going down with hunter this is not good this is bad for slaunch i think roman just snuck by as well so roman as hunter and slaunch are involved in an incident roman sneaks by he is now in second place in his first race um in hrl that is just insane who else was in second in their first hrl race i think rebel actually i think he finished second in his first race because he won the second moto i believe so yeah i think i think he did i think he got second Second or third, I don't really remember at this point. Second or third. Regardless, point is, the fact that Roman's in second already is insane. I mean, for his first race to be that high up, just a great uh, turnout for him. Hopefully, he can hold on to it throughout the rest of the throughout the rest of the race. This pack in the in the rhythm section here is getting really tight. Luke Detail, Camby, all still battling, I believe. Actually, it looks like Detail and Luke both have gotten by Camby. So it looks like Camby is out of that top five now. I think Detail holds the fifth place spot. Um, as far as I can tell, yep. Looks like Detail has the fifth place spot. Luke tails him in sixth, and then seventh is Camby. Not that far behind. That's a pretty tight pack right there. And they're actually... Is that Slaunch? They're actually right there on Slaunch for fourth as well. Not that far off. They might be able to make some moves. Hunter, though... Hunter is a, a bit further ahead, and obviously Roman um, is checked out of that pack at the moment. Um, Ump is in the rhythm section, so he's way far ahead too. Uh, Detail and Luke getting into it, slowing each other up a little bit. But it looks like Luke's going to be... Oh, that was risky. Holy crap. I don't know if anybody saw that, but between Luke, Detail, and then Camby, that was extremely, extremely risky right there. Oh, Camby with the crossover move on Detail. That was really solid. But is he going to be able to complete the pass? Uh, doesn't look like it. It looks like Detail should have the run, and he does. Vulcan getting lapped. It's a pretty good battle here that we're seeing for 5th, 6th, and 7th. Guys are fighting hard over those positions. Rebel is still pretty far back. Same with Fireball as well. Fireball getting lapped, so... Um, again, those guys, they're probably just trying to forget uh, this moto the best they possibly can. They're They're just moving on at this point and and uh, thinking in the future but they've got a while to wait before they can move on because we got three minutes left in this moto plenty of time Roman's still holding strong on the second place I mean look at that gap he's got on Hunter it's like a whole whole section he's got a whole section on him Slaunch is actually starting to... Oh, no, with that lap driver cheese, that is not going to help either. Slaunch is actually gaining Hunter. Hunter goes down at the end of the rhythm, and now Slaunch is competing with Hunter uh, for third place. Side by side. Is Slaunch going to be able to make a move? Nope. Has to back out of it a little bit. Not able to, to do anything yet. starting to settle out a little bit again um this race seems to go in patterns like that where it's really intense and then it settles out and then it's really intense then it settles out speaking of which we have slaunch going at it on hunter again and luke's catching up rapidly as well and obviously details not that far behind from him either so we could see a, a three to four way battle here soon and this could be it luke's right on the bumper of slaunch now so Definitely catching up. 
I'm not sure how long it's going to take detail for uh, for him to get to this pack, though. And did Slaunch? It looks like Slaunch did it. He gets by Hunter. Oh, and then Luke gets into the inside wall. Not going to help his race. Detail, obviously going to try to take advantage of that. Trying to get up there, make a move. But it looks like Slaunch has gotten by Hunter. Although Hunter, it, it looks like he's not done. It looks like he's trying to fight back. It's definitely odd seeing Hunter actually <laughs> this competitive on a Supercross track. He's genuinely fighting for position with Slaunch and possibly able to take it. I mean, he's right there in the inside. Is he going to be able to... Oh, he cuts him off. That was a brilliant move. Gets right in front of his line. But obviously, Slaunch isn't going to be done fighting yet either. Oh, man, this is going to be a crazy battle. Hunter and Slaunch just side by side, and then Luke and Detail still closing in. Might see a huge culmination um, soon of, of what this battle is bringing us. Ump, obviously, still your leader. Um, has, has had a quiet race, but just been quietly in the lead, running solid laps. Oh! <laughs> a near miss right there. That could have been bad. Flamefly is right in front of Ump, although I think Ump would have been fine. I mean, second place, Ump is like hitting the berm right now as Roman's entering the rhythm. So that's like a half a track lead on second place. But that battle, Hunter, Slaunch, Luke, and Detail still going down, and lap traffic's going to make it interesting. It looks like Hunter is going to run away with it, but now we have Luke and Detail really close, and Slaunch also being held up by lap traffic, so they'll probably catch up to him. Could see an exciting finish. Uh, for this battle between these drivers. Slaunch trying to get his way by that lap traffic. Gets by one of them. Still has another one to go, though. Oh, getting slowed up was Luke and Detail. I wonder if Detail is going to get affected by that as well. No, Luke gets affected harder. Detail goes right around him in the rhythm. Slaunch gets by the lap traffic. So now it's between Luke and Detail for that fifth place spot with lap traffic also playing a role. And as they exit the corner, it looks like looks like Detail was somehow able to make the pass on both of them. And Luke gets into the inside wall, trying to get by the lap traffic. So that's probably going to be it for that battle. So we hit the white flag lap. See if Ump's able to hold on to it. Should be able to. Has a huge lead on the on second place. And there he is, coming around the berm. And long time coming, but he's finally able to do it. At the halfway point of the season, Ump takes his first moto win of the season, which it's, it feels odd to say that because he's had a solid season. Obviously, he got a ton of moto wins towards the end of last season, so it feels odd to say that, that it's taken this long, but he's finally gotten it off his shoulders, and now he can focus on trying to get an overall. So the results show up on the screen. Roman also getting second in his first race. That is also huge for him. Um, Hunter getting a podium on Supercross. Just insane Luke finishing out of the top five. Also insane. Lots of crazy things happening in this race. Rebel finishing eighth. I mean, this is ridiculous. Your points leader finished tenth. So, um, kind of a, a ridiculous moto right there. A lot of unexpected things going down. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And definitely get ready for the second moto. It's going to have some very similar cheese. See you there.